and Penny, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all doing really, really well. Welcome to my holiday glow up vlog. This is where we're starting. We are decidedly grimy. We have got the things we need. So we have a comb, we have the bowl, we have the spatula, we have all the colours. Now, the first point of business is to separate my hair out and I need to bleach my roots at the front and take the colour out of the back so that's the first job so I've got two to strip the colour so I've got this colourless hair colour remover it says simply wash your colour away. Removes black, brown, red and build up. Safe and gentle, no bleach or ammonia. We've got this one. Or we've got this one. This is colour and before. Colour remover. Amo uh, safe and easy, ammonia and bleach free. Which is what we want. Which is what we want. we got... Now, I'm go I think I'm going to use this one first because this is the newest one. Um, and then I've also bought this, which is the Vital by Schwarzkopf because I do like Schwarzkopf. So I've got this to bleach. Um, it's not as bright as I normally go for bleach, um, but we're going to do this. And then we are going to put this on the back. But that will be later so this is what I'm doing now and then I will wash it all out and all that come back and show you what that looks like because it needs to be dry for the next round and then we will do that um, there's going to be several parts to this glow up so the first thing is well I've already done the first thing and that's my nails look we're going with this it's the Barry M molten metal in fuchsia pink so yeah, I did my nails. I didn't film doing them because I make a mess when I do them. I am not good at it. I am not good at it. So I've done my nails. That's part one, right? Now I'm hoping it stays as part one and doesn't become something else because the hair dye has ruined it because I probably did it the wrong way round. But the smell of the nail polish gives Paul a headache. And Paul was at work this weekend, so I did it deliberately while he was at work because obviously we go away next weekend, so he'll be around all be like he's he's not he's gonna be here when I would normally do it. So can't do that. He's off. So yeah, he's off for the next couple of weeks for our holiday. So yeah, not a lot I can do with that. So I've decided to do it while he was at work and it's just this. I will have to top up just before I go on holiday. You can see I make a mess. Look, I haven't quite got it all off around the outsides. See, it's a little bit, see, still janky around the, out, around the edges. I need to sort of get in there. But that comes off in the shower, see? And I haven't done that yet because I'm doing the hair thing, right? And when you're using bleach, you need dirty hair. So because it protects your scalp then see I just need to to bleach my roots and I'm hoping the bleach will take some of this pink out that's what I'm hoping because it's too bright the pink I'm gonna go is this color it's more of a pastely pink sort of up the top there um just lighter and this one I think is where I'm gonna go after my holiday in the front so this is the medium rose gold and I think this one is, yeah, this is light golden brown. And that's what I want in the back. So those are, we're not using those at the moment. We're just using these. I'm going to put this one back. Put that one back. We're not using that one today. We're using these. Now I'm going to go, I'm going to go and change my top because this is new. I don't want to get bleach on this. And then get rid of my jewellery in my hands anyway. Um, I can't my ears really and then I will come back and we will separate the hair and start the application okay one second okay and I'm back so we're going to separate my hair so I don't know if I can see all that well I don't know why it's gone very very dark in here but I've got all the lights on um, but if I open the curtain you can't see me at all because there's too much light behind me 
so I don't know what to do we just have to put up with this I think the kitchen would be better but as you've seen I can't go in there because my son has taken over my kitchen table with his um his computer set up and he has nowhere else to go apparently so I have to put up and shut up which I find quite rude um because you know my house but I don't know what to do really I'm trying to appease everybody and I can't appease anybody oh, I can't get that bit there we go There is some dark, extra dark in here. I'm going to, I think, bleach those bits as well. But I'm going to put the bleach on second because I don't usually keep it on all that long. I don't need to, you know. My hair turns quite quick. So I don't need to put loads of bleach on. I might need to leave it on a bit longer to try and get rid of the pink. But I will have a load of bleach left, even though, yeah. So what I will do is bleach bath it if I need to. I can use it to bleach bath. Right, I'm gonna go in the sun and do this. It's, I just can't see what I'm doing here very well. So back in a minute. Okay, so that's the front sectioned off. Then we've just got the back to do. There is some pink in it, I don't care. I don't care. It's a bit knotty. Excuse the arms. Bingo's coming out today. But it's too hot, you can hear the fan, I've got to have it on, it's too hot, and I'm menopausal, so. Right, let's get this out, see what we've got. So we've got, we've got a funnel. We've got that. A colourless remover. Colourless hair remover, that's number C. We got some gloves. Right, let's have a look. Instructions. One, using the funnel provided, pour the entire contents of sachet A into bottle B. Shake vigorously for two minutes to ensure the powder is fully saturated and leave to develop for 10 minutes. Shake for a further 60 seconds for use. Pre-warm hair with a hair dryer prior to application. Apply to clean dry hair using the entire contents and ensure hair is saturated. Leave on hair to process for 60 minutes. We strongly re recommend wrapping the hair in cling film and warming with a hair dryer and wrapping in a towel. It is important to keep the hair warm throughout the 60 minute process by regular use of a hair dryer. Okay. Rinse off lotion with warm water for 5 minutes. Apply half of bottle C and massage to lava like a shampoo for one minute. Now rinse with warm water for five minutes. Apply the remainder of bottle C, massage to a lava like shampoo for one minute. Now rinse with warm water for a further five minutes. We recommend finishing with a conditioner as colorants dry the hair. Okay. Right, so... This is going to be fun. I haven't got scissors. I'm, I'm going to find scissors and then my hair is, is, is well, it's, it's two days, two days since I washed it. That's all right, isn't it? I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Um, we're going to do it anyway because I need it. I can't wash it because of the bleach going on top. But I think I'm going to do the colourless thing, then bleach after I've no, I need to do it at the same time. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to do this and I will come back. I'm gonna, I need to go and find a hairdryer and some way of plugging a hairdryer in. Um, and then I need... I should have read all these instructions before I sat down to film. But you get to see how I am. I am sporadic and I just do things. So, yeah, I'm going to go and do all that and then I'll come back. I will mix this together and then I will yeah I've got a shower cap actually that I can tie around my hair yeah I've got a shower cap I can put that on um yeah that's what I'm gonna do I've got a shower cap I'll do that and then 
we'll go from there i will see you in seconds and i will be maybe slightly more prepared we will see okay got a hair dryer so we put that in there i still forgot the scissors damn it let's see if i can just rip it shall we and i can look at that bonus right so we just pour it in here So that goes in there and we put the lid back on and we have to shake it for two minutes this is gonna hurt this is really gonna hurt and that's coming out let me just tighten actually we do that And then clip. That's it. And you carry on. one One eternity later, I cut this out. You're not going to see it. Right, so that's done. Now I've got to wait 10 minutes. So I'm going to set a timer. Clock, where's the clock? There's clock. Clock, timer, 10. Right. So yeah, we've done that. I'm going to go away because... I don't know what to talk to you about for 10 full minutes and I will come back when the timer goes off and we're ready to start the application of putting it on my hair. So I will see you in a minute. Right, I have done the second lot of shaking and I have um, heated my hair with a hairdryer. So I'm just going to pour this in my bowl. I'm not quite sure how to go about putting this on my hair. Um, this hasn't mixed at all. That's ridiculous. I'm going to mix it up with the... No. No. All the powder's coming out. It's still not mixed. But I'm going to go away and I'm going to mix this up more and let it develop again. This is ridiculous. I don't know why I couldn't have just put it in a bowl in the first place. No. It's just not mixed up at all. It's quite a big lump, so I'm going to go and mix this up, and then we're going to start again, and then I'll be back. 
right we've done all that now I can start applying it now it's really really runny so I'm not quite sure how I'm going to get it on my head but I'm going to start by putting it here now I've got a mirror so if I'm looking down here it's because I need the mirror to see where my line is so do that get it at the top where it mixes with my hair other hair just do that you shouldn't work on that bit of my hair anyway because that is actually like it's not got any dye or anything on it it's my natural hair there huh. okay that needs to come forward right Ooh. Right, now, I'm going to do that and just slap it all over because, yeah, I don't know how else to do it, to be honest. Champagne, I'm totally vibing. It's true what they say, it's all about timing. I'm doing okay for the first time in a while. Can't help but love my style, just caught in the feeling. So much glitter, you can't forget her, a superstar. Like, ooh, we just get. So I need to bring it forward a bit. I am not, I am not going to bleach my hair yet. I'm going to leave this, do this treatment. Um, I'm now going to put the hair dryer on it um, and warm it up and keep doing that over the course of the next hour. And then I am going to, I'm going to set my timer for an hour. And then... I'm go yeah, I'm going to do this for an hour and then I'm going to go upstairs, wash it all off without washing the front bit. I'll probably do it in my... No, I'll do it upstairs because then I can just do the back and keep the front out and we'll go from there. Okay, so I'm going to set my timer clock for... No, that needs to go to zero. And that can go to one. One hour start. So there you go, one hour, and I will go upstairs, take it all off, that's come out, 
needs to go in. All of this, it's not gone in this side. That's not supposed. All right, that's because that's that. Right, we'll leave that out. So yeah, and I'm going to just use the hair dryer to heat it periodically. I'm going to do it now. I'll show you what I'm doing, and then I will come back once I have rinsed it all off and. Yeah, I think I'll probably do this off camera because I'll do it up in the bathroom. So I'll put this on, leave it for five minutes and rinse it off and then put it on again, leave it for five minutes and then rinse it off. So I will do all that and I will come back when I am wet, ready to dry. I've got my trusty hair dryer. So yeah, I will see you in a in your eyes under your spell oh it's like we've always right i will see you in a bit and i'm back and i've done it and it has done nothing nothing so for the rest of today i'm gonna take that no, i'm not gonna leave that in there a minute I've had to go out looking like this, which is a bit of a nightmare. Right, so we've done that. Then this here, we're going to pull this back so it's out of the way. Because it is literally, it has taken no colour off it at all. So, we're going to leave that bit for now. We're going to do the bleach of the front bit. And we're going to get this to a colour that we can work with. So, this is the one that I've got. I like spots cloth, but I normally use the live one. This is not the live one. This is a different one. Um, and it shows, like, all the blondes there, and it should lighten. I'm not so worried about it lightening. I'm more worried... Oh, drop the instructions... I'm more worried about it getting the pink out. Right, here we go. Preparation. Mixing. Unscrew the nozzle of the developer. Open. I'm going to put it in this, but I will mix it together in that. Right. Two thirds of the mixture throughout the whole regrowth area. Make a part in from the top right. We're doing that. And then apply the mixture to develop for 20 minutes. And then apply the remaining mixture to the mid lengths and ends for a further 10 minutes. Yeah. I got some. Where's the dog? He's with Christopher. Mm. He wants to be with Christopher. And Christopher said it's fine. So Max is with Christopher. I didn't see him. I was just talking to Christopher. He's probably under the table. He likes to be at his feet. I'm, 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 I'm going to do us boys a fry up this morning. Oh, are you? Mm. Nice. Right. So. Yes, nice, but it's made me very hungry now. Well, that's good. You're mm. going to get a roast dinner. Paul's getting a roast dinner tonight. And he's hungry now. And he's getting impatient. There he is. My bending knees for you. Yes. Well. <laughs> it's been a long day. <laughs> it has, yeah. He's not... Paul isn't like normal people when it comes to his food. He tends to just eat once a day and eat enough for three meals in that one meal. Bed meets food makes no difference. Yeah. Yeah. One day I'll try one of his um, challenges. Yeah. I'll fail. Oh, sorry. I'll fail, but I'll try it. What colour are you going for? Blonde. It looks very white. <laughs> what colour did you expect blonde to be? Just out of interest, Paul. Yellow. Well, it will be because the bit underneath this is yellow. This is just one of the ingredients. Well, it just shows so, that how often I dyed my hair or someone else's. Mm -hmm. I have actually, to be fair. 
Yeah. I have done both, but not for a long time. Not very often. No. And you were probably just told what to do. Um, I don't know. My mohawk was quite full. Red and blue. This one I had hair. He has hair. I had hair. You have hair. I mean, it's growing out the bottom of your face rather than the top. <laughs> But you Gravity's have it. Taking hold. Huh? Gravity is taking hold. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Now I need a I need a grip. Hold on, I need to go and find me a stabby clawy grip thing. Hold on. Right. No dog. Yeah. We've got no dog. He's in with Oh, Christopher. He loves Christopher. Because Christopher, I do walk him. I need to get it. I might as well. This hasn't done nothing, so I'm going to bring it forward again. So it's part of it. Look. See? There. Now, I need this mirror. Because I can't see in that. To put this. No, this is definitely bleach. I can smell it. for 20 minutes i'm just gonna one second i'm gonna go and grab my other phone and then set a timer one second okay so i got this one and we're gonna go 20 minutes there we go 20 minutes and we'll see how it goes and then I'm, i am gonna put it all through the out the rest of it but just because i want it to it's only for 10 minutes and i just want it to get rid of the rest and then i'm gonna go through to my kitchen i'm gonna rinse it off in my sink because that's the easiest place for me to do it and then we'll go from there we'll go from there and i'll probably dry it see how we're getting on and then i might try and stick some hair dye on it because yeah the front is going this color and the back is going this color so it should lift it a bit it's got dark brown to soft black and it does lighten it and mine is more of a dark brown so if you look there at the bottom one it should put like a goldeny brown for it which is fine with me that that worked just fine or i've got this one and this one it's not recommended for because this one is one for my front bit after my holiday i want to go a bit more of a lighter pink but for my holiday, I definitely want pink. So we're going to go with this one. This one's a lot pink. And you do need blonde hair for it. So that's why we're, we're bleaching the front. I've got to admit, this is not turning as quickly as it normally does for me. I'll be honest. Normally, I'm already looking at some blonde now. But we'll give it... We'll give it the full time. And we'll see see how we get on i will see you in a bit all right 
Back in a minute. And I'm back. Right, we're going to... Oh, it is turning. Look, we're going to put this through the rest of my hair. Just put it through in the hopes that we get rid of some of this pink. <laughs> Pink champagne, I'm totally vibing It's true what they say, it's all about timing I'm doing okay, for the first time in a while Can't help but love my style, just caught in the feeling I'm so much glitter, you can't forget her A superstar, like ooh, we just get that i've still got some left um but this this bleach i'll be honest i do recommend it it does feel nice so far hopefully i won't eat my words in 20 minutes when this goes wrong but i'm hoping that that will be the end of the bleach i quite like i say if this goes well i am going to be using this bleach in future for start off this only cost me two pound fifty at home bargains it's schwarzkopf so it is a reputable brand and second off it's you know it's not that horrible crunchy powder bleach i don't like that i've decided i don't like that stuff so we're just going to leave this to sit on the top of my head i'm going to go and sit another timer for 20 minutes and then i will see you again when i've managed to go through and dry it and yeah see how we go all right, so I will see you in a bit. This is ongoing. It's going to be going for a while. A little bit. All right, see you in a bit. Right, that's better. That's better. That is decidedly less blue. There is still a tinge of blue, but it's less than it was. Um, and I, yeah, I mean, I've still got a brown stripe there. Um, I think that, I think I have brought that over from the back while drying it. I think that's what's gone on here but yeah it's looking okay it is looking okay i am liking what i've got here as a base remember it's a base not the finished product now yeah that was paul sorry about that he's singing right so what i'm going to do now i'm going to eat my dinner while looking frightful then I will come back and we are going to start with the colour. So, let's just recap. We are going to be putting this on the back and this on the front. Oh, that brings back some memories. Yep. That's not one you used. Oh, you, that's the no. one I used for prom. Oh, that's the one I used for prom. This is the one Lucy used for her prom. But we're not using that one today. There's Lucy. Shh, that's not the one we're using today. Today we are using those two that I just showed you. And that, but that is after I've had my tea. Because we've got a roast. Yes. Christopher has cooked us a roast. Oh, wow. Paul, what's that? That's Look. just the Yorkshire puddings. This is the Yorkshire puddings my son produced. Bloody Homemade hell. Yorkshire puddings. You've got three each. Three? Three? Oh, well, you don't eat them. I don't eat them. There you go. Yeah, we've got three each. <laughs> Didn't know we were yeah, I, I don't, I don't eat Yorkshire pudding. Unfortunately, I don't like it. No. 
you're going to need my table, aren't you? Yeah. Right. We are going to go and have our dinner and then I will be back here ready and raring to go for round five and six, maybe three and four. No, I did round one, strip. Round two, bleach. Round three, bleach. Round four, colour and colour. So I will see you in a bit. And I'm back. I've had my dinner. Now full up. Here we go. We have the colour. I've mixed it up. We're going in with this one first. This is this is supposed to be, I think it's like the it was the colorista. Now it's called this. I don't know. But it's a pastel pink. Now my hair, it has a tinge of um yeah, it has a tinge of blue still. I don't care. We're gonna do it because otherwise I'm gonna be here all night night, and I don't want to be here all night. Because yeah, I've got to go out tomorrow, so I need to be acceptable tomorrow. So, I'm not quite sure how to do this, because it's a squeegee thing. I'm not used to doing my colour with a squeegee thing. So, let's just... Put some colour in. in your eyes under your spell oh it's like we've always known it even though it's new i can already tell all oh, that this feeling is taking over can we take our time i want to savor us my mind of you and I getting together right that is colour number one on so I can throw away the gloves because I have a box of gloves out in the kitchen by where I'm going to rinse this top one off now I'm going to do the second one and I'm guessing that this is pretty much the same. Yeah, we've got another one of these things. That's why I've got two of them now. I don't know. And we got this. Now, I am going to keep this bottle because I've got another round in there if this needs another round on it after I've done this. So I will keep it. Um, for like immediate use and then we just pour this into here this one's got to stay on for half an hour so I'm going to set my alarm for half an hour So that one's going there and then what I'll do is I'll start another timer for this one for when this one's been on so I'm just gonna give it a good shake just going to take out the back like that I'm going to brush it brush it out and then at the back I start at the bottom and go up so what I'll do is sort of section it like this and then just take a toggle and just put it Round there just to section it up so that I can do this bit first. That's like that where I put the gloves that come with them. Found them. Yeah. Oh, I still need some, Lou. For some reason, these are missing a thumb. They're missing a thumb. 
that's weird look look i'll show you look what's the point in that what's this one i don't know this one's got a thumb ridiculous lucy's just getting me another glove so i will be back in a second right so we're gonna go in with the brown go in at the back so i'm just gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna put it on my hand and then go in oh the ammonia is strong in this one Wow. This isn't working. I'm fucking in, so if you need me, wave at me. Yeah. Got it. in your eyes under your spell oh it's like we've always known it even though it's new i can already tell all oh, that this feeling is taking over can we take our time i want to savor us on my mind of you and I getting together right we are in I am now going to set up a additional timer for 30 minutes so it's 10 minutes less than this front one, which is good because it will give me chance to rinse that top one out. And it's going pink. I'm hoping to God this takes okay. I hope so. It's looking pink. But whether or not the hair goes pink, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. If not, I might have to resort to my other one. But we'll see when we get there. And then the back, I'm hoping it will lighten up a bit. Just a bit. You know, I just want it a bit lighter. Um, a lot of people said after I put the curly wig on that the lighter colours suited me. And that's what I'm going for. But first, I, I'm i not quite ready to let go of pink. You know? Not quite ready. Not quite ready to let go of it. So, yeah, basically, that's what I'm going to do. I am going to go um, let this sit on my head for half an hour then i will go i will rinse the front bit off and put some of the conditioner in it i will then leave that on the top of my head go upstairs i'm going to have a shower rinse the back bit off because then i can get under my shower and do the back and leave the front out that's what i do is i put the front in the clip in a clip and keep it out of the way so that colors don't bleed together either way it's not going to have the flecks of silver in it anymore which is basically as much as we can hope for. But I think this pink, I like. I think it's it matches my eyes. It looks... Yeah, I'm liking it. I'm liking it. And if it doesn't work the first round, I've got plenty here. I can do another round. But I'm hoping it won't. I hope, I'm hoping it will work. But I will come back once it's all done. Excuse the train. Unfortunately, the train line is the end of the garden. So, yeah, I will come back and I will let you see how we're going so far. But I've got some cleaning up to do in the meantime because I've got a load of boxes here and I'd rather get them a bit out of the way because of Maximilian. So, yeah, we're going to do that. So, I will see you in a little while. Okay, this is the final result. What do we think? 
it's not really pink I'll give you that it's got a hint of a pink in it and it's got a hint of orange under there but you know I'm not really bothered by that it's uh, it's definitely different um, it's definitely what I'm going to be having for the next couple of weeks I'm not doing anything else to it for the next couple of weeks so yeah this is the end of the hair part of my glow up and uh, yeah so the next time you see me so we've done nails we've done hair done its eyebrows and I'll get waxed but that won't be on here but you'll know it will happen uh, what else have I got to do for my glow up probably going to finish with giving myself a facial dermaplane and facial and that'll be at the end of the week but yeah that's the end of this bit I do hope you enjoyed the hair part of this video and you stick around for the rest of it okay I will see you for the next part bye for now hello right now this is the hair and I do like it but it's not pink enough for me so I've forgotten my gloves. If I had a brain, I'd be dangerous. I will be back. One second. One second. Right, I'm back. I've got gloves. Now, my big box of gloves, they've all gone. Nobody tells me anything. They take the last one, they don't say anything. But I've got these. Um, I got them from other, uh, what do you call them, dye boxes because... I've got my own, so I don't use them. So I've got a stash of those. What I'm doing today is, right, we've got Miss Cerise pink, but I don't want it that pink. So I've got conditioners. I've got a couple here. I've got this one and this one. And yeah, so I, if you mix it with conditioner, it dilutes it. So I want it pale pink. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix it up. I'm just going to put, I've got a little measuring spoon here. And this is a tablespoon right or tea is it i can't read it it's 15 ml right so i'm going to put 15 ml of this and then this bottle of conditioner into my bowl i'm i'm only doing the front so i don't need loads i'm going to do that and then and then right because i'm getting my eyebrows waxed later Allure. We're going to dye my brows. We're going to dye them dark brown. So that's exciting. I've never done it before. So we will learn together. So there's that. Um, yeah, so let's, I'm going to mix up the dye. I'm not putting gloves on for this because I, yeah, can't be bothered. Right. So I'm just doing that. That's quite a bit. Right, I've got a towel so I'm just going to put that on a towel and then close the dye up I hate doing this in my bedroom I hate it I prefer to do it in the kitchen and I can't because no beds or ugh. my boys are or my boy is got his computer set up at my dining room table which I normally stick a cover on it and then do it there Oh, come on. Right, I'm going to put this back on. Shake it down. Back up my arm. There, so we've got that. We leave that upside down. We might be able to get a bit more. And then I've got me and me, oh, whatever this is called. We're going to mix that up. I'm going to put some more conditioner in this. This is not enough so i'm going to use this this is the preference by l'oreal it's one to lock in color or whatever when you have your your other one i'm just going to chuck that in right as well squidgy 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 all of it's going in i'm probably going to have too much dye but what i'll do is i will get a little pot and put it in so i've got it for topping it up throughout the summer right that's still it's quite dark look I don't want it dark so I think I'm going to go in with this one 
if I can get in it. If if I had a brain, I'd have scissors and I'd be, you know, properly ready. But I'm I'm a bad YouTuber and yeah, I'm not ready. Never ready. Here we go. Squidgy, squidgy, squidgy. I think it's still going to look quite dark, even though it's quite diluted. So, but that's more of the colour I want. That's a bit better. That it's sort of a bright pink. And it won't be that colour, I don't think, once it's done. Because that dark pink comes out quite um, vibrant pink. That's why I put the purple dye in it very often. Right. Now, I'm just going to, I'm going to go off camera and separate my hair out because I need the daylight and that to do it. And then I will be back. Okay, we separated. We separated it out. So this is the first bit. Right, I'm going to put my gloves on. I don't know why I'm bothering. Look at that. But I just don't want them any worse than that. So we'll put gloves on. That'll come off while I'm washing my hair out and everything. So yeah, so gloves. Okay. So what I tend to do, I have my comb and then I pull a bit out just like that. So we just pull that out. That can go up there and then just comb that there. And then I've got a little clip. So we just clip the rest of that away and we start here. So I do use a brush and then just to sort of do the edges like that just so that I try not to throw it everywhere, but it will go on my face and I don't care, it will come off. You'll see, you'll see. And then we just paint it and then use the, like that, pull it through like so, see? And then that's saturated. And then I take the clip off. I'm gonna get everything messy in pink. And then just pull a bit out. I don't need to worry too much about sectioning because this in itself is a section. You know, this one bit at the front, it's it's a section. So yeah, I don't worry. Don't worry about the clip at all because it's on the floor. And I don't want to get my put my gloves on the floor. My flooring is very old before anybody worries. It is very, very old. And it needs redoing, but all the time I've got Max, because it's a, a laminate type floor, all the time I've got Max and the garden where it is, I'm not going to put like carpet or anything down. Um, and I'm hoping, hoping in the next month or so, that I'll get my beauty room done. I've got a shed in the garden. You'll have seen it in the pictures. It needs some... Um, fixing up it's not perfect but I'm gonna put some like insulation inside and just fix up where it needs fixing around the outside I've got to get some windows for it um, it needs new window because it's broken and then um, I'll paint it inside do it up I'm gonna go and get a bit of carpet for it yeah maybe might do laminate in there actually and just get a rug I think that way I can still do like this but do it in there and then that will be my beauty room and that will be where I go to film so I can have my setup up so it takes me less time to set it all up every time I want to film it will be set up ready to go um, I'll be able to film try-ons in there I mean I'll still do stuff inside the house like the shopping and everything but like my try-ons I can do in there. Um, I'm going to get a hanging rail so that like, I can hang up the clothes that I'm going to try on. That sort of thing. Just, yeah, just tart it up a bit so I've got somewhere I can go. Um, do little bits like this and yeah, just, just somewhere I can go to do stuff. So that I can have it all set up to film and yeah, just... Yeah, just something I've always wanted and I haven't got room in my house because I've got too many people for the house as it is. Um, I've only got a three bedroom house and 
there are five of us that live here and we're all adults so people are sharing which is why I'm in the lounge not in a bedroom upstairs that and um, I still even though I go I do go upstairs and shower and that I can't I would struggle to use the stairs every day sort of thing some days I would struggle to get down the stairs if you know what I mean so yeah I've got a downstairs toilet and that that I can use so some days you know I can go a while without going up there when I'm having a really bad time I stay downstairs I've got like a, a room I can go to where I can get like a wash and everything I can't get a shower in there but I can wash and that which is pretty good um, and obviously I when I'm having a really bad day I well quite often Lucy has to help me um, just with little bits when I'm in a right state so that's there yeah that's that one done gloves is minging we're gonna take them off uh, I'm gonna put those there oh. I've got it all over my hands now trying to avoid that look never mind what I'm going to do I'm going to go and take this I'm going to find a pot to decant it into because I've got loads left look and so that will keep me going while I'm you know over the summer until I want to go I think I'm going to the summer I'm going to stay more pink and then sort of end of August beginning of September I'm going to take it to more of a golden brown or blonde blonde I think for the winter and then sort of towards Christmas time I think I'm going to put a few red streaks in it rather than doing the whole thing red I think I think watch this but it could change it could change but I'm going to go and get rid of that wash my hands and then we'll come back and I will do my eyebrows okay I've got to go and get all the stuff I need for that I've got a little pot this was my it's going to you won't see it in my empties but this is the Peptide Calm Cleansing Balm Innard because they're refillable from Beauty Crop. And this little pot looked perfect to mix up eyebrow dye. So I'm going to go and do that, um, get sorted for that. And then I will come back to you and we will do my eyebrows. So I'll see you in a second. OK, so we got the dye and I've got the instructions. Now it says... Uh, important right cleanse the eyebrows so I've got some micellar water I'm just gonna do that and then dry it I'm not going to take my eyebrow studs out because whenever I've had this done at a salon they don't take them out so I'm just going to leave them where they are that I hate putting the damn things back in now pain it's hard work right then we have got to put a barrier cream like a balm around the eyelids I need can I need a couple of your cotton buds of course you can. thank you some q-tips And I've got this Miracle Balm from Revolution. It's just a balm. It's just what I have. So I'm just going to take the tiniest bit on the Q-tip. And then I'm going to get my mirror. And I'm just going to put this around the eyebrow where I don't want it to tint. Put it there I know I should do this with my hair right but I don't so yay go me I'm not that bothered by that so blob there just 
put it round there and there and just there now I'm doing this now because I'm going to get my eyebrows waxed in a few hours um, as part of this glow up I will see if I can film but I probably won't be able to because I have to go on my own and so the lady will be doing it and then I won't have anyone to hold the camera while she does it <clears throat> I will maybe see if I can but if not yeah I'll just show you the before and after so we then have to squeeze open this and then pop the top and it's one centimeter of this into the tray it's about a centimeter I'll show you hold on so there that's about a centimeter and then we've got to do the same for this this one so we'll put that alongside it Oop. Okay, bit much maybe, no, I don't know, right, and that's what it looks like. And then I'm going to get the spoolie and just mix it together. It doesn't look like anywhere near enough to be able to do my eyebrows. It looks too little, but I'm going to do another centimetre. Yep. And then another centimeter of this. And then mix that together. There we go. That's a bit better. It looks like I've actually got some product now. doesn't look very dark that's what it looks like right and then apparently hold on I've got ha, got a little mirror little one right and then we just brush it through the eyebrows there we go And then load up, do this one. It does say to do one at a time. Yeah, I'm not doing that, can't bother. This one's hairier than the other one, I don't know why. Paul, would you set me a timer for 10 minutes, please? Thank you. There we go. Right, so that's on. That's got to stay on for 10 minutes. So I'm going to go away. I'm probably going to make myself a coffee because I'm actually gagging for a coffee right now. I'm going to clean up this stuff. And then I will be back when it's time to take it off. I will get a little tub of like water and soap to wash it off. And I will see you in a minute. So, see you in a bit. Right, we're back. The alarm's gone off. Cool, they've gone dark, haven't they? Oh, yeah, they, they're very dark. Right, so I've got a little pot of water with um, just some of my cleanser in. I'm using the CeraVe one at the moment just to use it up. And I'm just going to wipe them off and we'll see... Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, I like that. That worked really well. And I'm right that it didn't dye my piercings at all. There. Right there, we'll do a bit there. Look. See, it comes off fairly easily off my skin. 
it's not permanent or anything so you just rub it when I wash it off usually it comes off pretty easily right look I've got a towel here I'm just gonna wipe it or dry it old towel excuse the state of it but it's old because that's what you use for dyeing Right, let's have a look, shall we? Oh yeah, look. That looks alright, doesn't it? Like I say, I am getting them waxed later today. So they'll get all tidied up. But yeah, I'm I'm re I'm well happy. That's well good. Why would you pay someone to do this? Yeah, I like that. I like that. That that's worked really, really well. Right then, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go, I've got to leave this on my head for another, I don't know, 20 minutes or so. And then I will go and wash it out, go and have a shower, come down and I'll probably set you up over on my bed where I can do my skincare and that. And then I will, no, I'll leave you here. I, I'll, you've seen my skincare routine loads of times. So I'll go and do my skincare and then I'll come back once I've dried it and styled it. And I will show you how it looks. So I will see you in a bit. I did it. I did it. I finished all my glow up. This is it. We are done. This is my hair. It's come out pink again. And I like it. Like I said, it's a lighter pink. And I think this, I do like this. I do like this. I've done my makeup. I had my eyebrows waxed. So that's the tint. Um, I haven't put any other product except a brow clear brow glue in. So you can see my eyebrows. They've been tinted. I am waxed. I am, yeah, all ready for my holiday. I've done my nails and I'm all ready for my holiday. So this is it. This is the complete holiday glow up. Done. Anyway, I do so hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd love it if you give me a thumbs up. Subscribe down below for more videos to come. And hopefully I will see you in my next one. Bye for now. <laughs>